What's up, y'all? This your girl, Gold Mouth, coming at y'all with a new video. Hey, y'all. Now, I know a lot of y'all been like, where is Gold Mouth, girl? Where she been? She ain't uploading no videos. I wonder how she doing. I hope she's doing okay. Listen, y'all. I am doing fine. I am doing okay now. Been going through a lot, y'all. I've been through a couple of sessions of therapy. Okay, I'm going to just pause right there because I might need a moment of silence. <clears throat> Because what I realized after going through just two sessions of therapy, I do have a couple of more appointments on, you know, scheduled in the future. Um, that y'all are my best form of therapy. Y'all, y'all have helped me more than these little stupid therapists that think they know what they're talking about in people's life when they don't know. You know, y'all have watched me enough to really know a lot more about me than an actual therapist because that's just some stranger who just hear you talk and um they, they they don't know anything about you they sum you up within like what your 10 minutes to tell them a little bit about your life and they oh well you just like this and you just like no i don't think you do know the answer boo, because you don't know me you haven't even watched me enough to even get a little glimpse of how i may be or may not be so you know, with the advice that they gave, it was like, okay, I'm going to need you to take this prescription to the doctor so you can get on some more medication, maybe some antidepressants. And at first I was like, okay, okay, I'm going to take it. Took it to my doctor. They referred me to a psychiatrist, which, Lord, listen, I didn't come on this video for this. So we just going to topic, we just going to name the topic of this video something else because what I came on, I didn't, I didn't do. So I'm going to just go with the flow, you know. So anyways, yes, um. Uh, yeah, so go get some more medication and, and, and all of this stuff. And, and and it's been a lot. It's been heavy on my mind, all of these thoughts and all this stuff. And I realize that the best person to help me is myself. Even though I did do still need help, I'm going to get my help from y'all. I feel like even though it might not seem like, okay, I'm being helped by a an actual licensed therapist because these people that I went to this lady that I went to she got all these degrees and licenses and, and, and plaques and all of this stuff and she still could not even talk to me properly she couldn't even hold a conversation with me all she wanted to know is well how many kids do you have well where do you from where are you from I don't need all of that and that was on the second session too okay so and if but I'm, I feel like if I'm spilling my heart to you telling you my problems I'm gonna need I'm gonna need for you to tell me how to deal with certain situations but you're not telling me that all you telling me to do is go to a doctor and get you some antidepressants lady okay so once I take the antidepressants woman and the drug wears off then what is that gonna solve my problems am I gonna feel better what you know, I don't, I don't like that. You know, I know I need some help and it's, it's a little bit more than an actual therapist because from, from what I have experienced in these last first two sessions is not the business. Um, okay. Listen, we're going to go in depth about that therapist lady on another video, but for right now, I'm going to talk about my next session, which is going to be another lady because we had to cancel the first lady boo because now, you know, I'm going to keep it, I'm going to keep it rolling since, since, since it's on, I'm going to keep going. So listen to me now. Okay. I'm in therapy, counseling or whatever you want to call it, telling this lady my deepest, most darkest problems and you know what, what I want. This is like this. <gasps> Seriously, like, and then I'm talking, I'm looking at her, and then next thing I know, she's like this. And I'm like, talking. Then she wakes up and she say, you don't really want to talk to me, do you? Bitch, you really don't want to listen. You really don't want to listen to me. Because I thought. I thought your job was to listen to people who got problems so you can try to help them figure out how to fix it. But apparently, you got problems of your own. I might need to be in here fixing you when I'm the one that's supposed to have the problems. So, yeah, that's how it went in therapy. No lie. No lie. So, I called. I didn't tell her that when I was in there, mind you. I didn't, because I didn't want to be rude, because she was nice outside of going to sleep on me. And she did not only go to sleep one time, but two times, and then a third time. She was like this. 
And at first I thought she was just like looking down at her paper because she was writing little notes. She was trying her best to stay woke. She kept yawning. She kept yawning. And then after a while it was like, then I thought she was looking at the notes because she was like this. And then her head did like this. Then she say, ooh, you seem sleepy. And I'm like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me right now? Like, are you serious? That's, that's how I feel. Like, lady, are you serious? This is your job, what you get paid to do. Oh, that woke me up. That woke, That's all I needed from therapy right there is to, 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 to know. I needed to be reassured that there is nobody that can help me to certify because I'm lady. If you certified, you got all these licenses, and you went to school for umpteen years to learn how to help people that's dealing with depression and anxiety and problems like the ones that I possessed. ED, with the ED on the end. Lady. You're going to need your new profession because this ain't how it roll. This ain't how it go. So, anyway, long story short, that same day when I left therapy, she, y'all can tell I feel good today, right? Okay, me, my, I'm feeling good, okay. Hands is okay at the moment. They was feeling all right, you know, a little creaky today, but uh -uh, they okay now. But anyway, long story short, I left therapy that day. I left therapy that day, called back up there to speak to the office manager and let her know what happened in the session that the lady was literally going to sleep. I had to actually shut up from what I was telling her because I didn't want to, I didn't feel, I already did not feel comfortable when I went to my very first session because this is a complete stranger and I didn't feel like telling her my business even though they certified to handle stuff like this and they're not supposed to tell what, what you said between you and them. I don't trust that. Do you trust that? No, nah, I don't trust She gonna go tell. Anyway, so that way I'm limit. I'm gonna limit what I tell her. Look, y'all. Oh. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna limit what I tell her. Just to, you know, just to get a feel. I want to feel her vibe talking to me. I ain't finna just blurt all of that because the people say you aren't supposed to tell. But that don't mean you're not gonna tell. For real. Like, for real. Okay, like, I'm not supposed to talk about you behind your back but when you leave i will don't get it twisted okay so i'm limited in the stuff that i'm telling her she asked me about my family blah 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 blah. well maybe you just need a vacation i don't need you to tell me that i need a vacation i can tell myself that if i have to pay you my money in order to tell you that i need a vacation then i can stay home and therapy myself and just talk to the camera and have my people on youtube set me free you feel me because it's enough of y'all that leave enough comments and i get enough comments and 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 suggestions from plenty of different people that are around the world that help me more than just one lady sitting over there in the corner half sleep okay and i use y'all advice to my benefit even though sometimes it, it, it don't seem like it i i, I listen i listen to all of y'all even if i don't respond to some of your, your comments i still read them i read every last one and if you got some good information i'm taking it at heart and i'm writing it down and i'm following through with it if you send me video suggestions prayer suggestions anything i take it down i look at it but i was so boggled up into all it people shooting me stuff here people shooting me stuff there saying this saying that saying this negative comments let me hold on pause let me let me bring the gold mouth back <clears throat> bitch do not come for me. Not today. Not tomorrow. And not now time next week. Because you got the wrong one. Because on my um, sad video, bitch, I have a right to be sad just like you. Um, Somebody said, oh, it look like you act like you mad at the whole world. Bitch, if I want to be mad at the whole world, then I can. Thank you. That's all I got to say. So quit coming to BS on my video because I am not the one, okay? I am not here for it. I'm not the one. Ain't nothing changed about me. Ain't nothing changed about me except a little sick, but I'm all right now. You know, I may have my moments where I go up and down, all around or whatever, but don't ever come to me throwing crap at me and think I'm just going to be like, <laughs> no. I might be like that for a while because I might be depressed at the moment or feeling down at the moment because my emotions are all crazy sometimes. But no, bitch, don't get it twisted, okay? We're going to leave it right there. So anyways, for the ones who leave me positive comments, I love y'all to death. And that's pretty much all of y'all. I just get one. It only take one bad apple to spoil the whole bunch sometimes. So you kind of like, you can get a hundred good comments and then you get one negative comment that will ruin all of y'all hundreds of good comments and positive comments. I know a lot of y'all say, don't let nobody bring you down. But no, I ain't letting nobody bring me down. I'm just 
just putting somebody in check. That's all, boo. That's all. Okay. So, um, anyways, the lady, the therapist lady that I'm going to, I'm scheduled to see next. I don't know who she is, but how about the lady at the, the therapy counseling center, um, said that the lady that she scheduled me to see at my next appointment, which is May 7th, um, she next door to the lady that I don't want to see. You feel me? So now I got to pass by this wench in order to get to the one, the new lady. You feel me? So, you know, y'all, it's just, it's just a lot. So, I mean, it don't bother me at all because I can pass by her and roll my eyes and suck my teeth at her. It's real, for real. And then now I got to get, I got to get to know this new lady and then start all over again telling my business like, Lady, listen, I'm tired of going through this. I'm not finna keep repeating with things I already done got off of my chest. Now I got to re-get them off of my chest again. <sighs> this is not the business. So, y'all, I bought me a self-help book off Amazon. So, um, to see if I can help myself. It is a book. It had a lot of reviews. I have not even started reading it yet, but I have high hopes because I read the reviews. And hopefully, 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 you know, I can get some you know, inspiration from it and, and going on with my life. So I've been having my Bible. I've been in, I found like different odds and things to do, like read books. I, I have really tuned into reading my books that I, I've always been a reader. And, um, I just got some more books from the library and which is, um, hair care books, by the way, because that's, that's what I like to do the most. That's what I'm interested in the most is learning how to grow hair, learning how to treat black hair. I've always been interested in that. Um, ever since I was a little girl, you know, I've always been interested in how hair grows and why hair can grow. Well, not really hair growth. I've been interested in hair growth these last couple of years, but ever since I was a little girl, I was into doing hair and wanting to style hair. And Okay, so my camera had died, but anyway, um, I am into a lot of books and stuff now. I'm doing good. I'm doing better. I'm coming back to YouTube. I'm coming back, y'all. Get ready. Get ready because I'm coming back because I can't just keep sitting home crying and pouting and worrying about what everybody else doing that I'm not doing. Why, why, why worry about what Susie doing and I'm sitting home ain't doing nothing? Why? Why? Girl, okay, yeah. so in my next video, I'm going to be coming to y'all with this same outfit on, whatever, and I'm going to show y'all how I lay my baby hair because they is a hot mess, y'all. So if y'all got any, 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 any video requests, any questions, any comments, y'all leave them below. Leave them below. And y'all, my bonus are always available at goldencreations.webs.com. Don't even, don't forget that. This is the Wonder Woman bun. Uh, this is the one I've been rocking lately. And um, so if y'all want to purchase a bonnet, please feel free to go to my website. The details will be in the description box below, y'all. Y'all support us, so to help us aside, y'all, because my journey is not over. But it ain't mine no more. It's the Lord's. But that's all I got to say in this video, and I will holler at y'all later. Bye!